Today the topic of discussion is tree data structures and in tree data structures we are going to understand generating binary tree using tree traversal. Prior to this we have seen tree traversal of binary tree that is pre-order, post-order and in order and now we use those traversal to create the tree. Now process is reverse, reverse engineering. Okay, let's start. Okay, so prior to this we have studied this. Uh, that is pre-order traversal, in-order traversal and post-order traversal. The traversal was uh, root left right and left root right and left right root. Hope you remember all those things. Clear? Fine. Okay. Now the question is this. This is the question. Given the pre-order and in-order and you have to create a tree. Given the pre-order and in-order and you have to cre create a tree. Always remember. Always remember if you are asked to create a tree then one order which is mandatory is in-order. Either it will be in order pre order, either it will be in order post order, but in order will be mandatory. In order will be mandatory in binary tree. I am again emphasizing if you have given a tree to if you have given a, a orders and you are asked to create a tree, then in that order, in order will be compulsory. Fine. Okay. So let's start with uh, creating a tree. I don't know what will be my tree. I don't know what will be tr my tree, but as I've told you earlier that. The first element of pre-order is root. I don't know what will be my tree, but I know one thing very clearly that my root is 10. I don't know what will be the tree, what, what will be the element of tree, but I know this very well that whatever may be the tree, but tree root will be 10. Fine. So hope this, this is clear to you. Now I'm changing the color of my uh, marker and I'm trying to explain you everything. Now this is the first step. Second step, go to in order go to in order okay fine go to in order yes i'll go to in order and check that where 10 is coming okay 10 is coming here then see what are left to 10 40 20 and 50 right on the left hand of 40 20 and i'm i'm, I'm 40 20 and 50 fine and right on the right hand of 10 what is right of 10 30 only 30 fine okay if there is only one element then it's sure that 30 will come over here then it's sure that 30 will come over here but if i talk about left side there are three elements 40 20 and 50 i don't know which element will come and take this position i don't know what will come over here either it will be 40 or 20 or 50 what i'll do i'll follow the pre-order now uh, my work for in order is over now i'll not see in order i'll go to the pre-order and in pre-order root start from this place i'll follow this place and among 40 20 50 which is coming first 40 20 is coming first so among all these two element all these three element 20 has one so 20 has acquired the position fine now comes two element one is 40 and one is 50 it is very obvious that 20 40 is left to 20 then 40 will come to the left and 50 is right of 20, 50 will come on to the right. So this is the required tree. So this is the required tree. If you want to match the answer, match the answer. See, this was our original tree and this is tree which we have created right now using order. Fine. It's fine. Hope you understand. Okay. Let's start with second question. Okay, so again the traversal is given, the formula is given, you are given order. Now you have given in order and post order. And now your job is to create a tree. Okay, I don't know what will be my tree. I really, I really don't know what will be my tree. But I know one thing very, very, very well that the last element of post order is root. The last element of post order is root. Fine. So I don't know what will be a tree, but I know one thing very clearly that whatever may be the tree, the tree will always have a root 10. Fine. Okay. Now again, go to in order, in order and see where 10 is existing. Yes. Find what are left to 10. Left to 10 are, find what are left to 10. Make a left edge, write 40, 20 and 50. 50. These are left to 10 and write what are left right of 10 only one element 30 so i know i can write simply 30 over here i can write simply 
30 over here because 30 is the only element over here. So 30 will come here. Fine. Now I don't know what will come over here. Which element will come over here? See, either it will be 40, 20 or 50. What I'll do, I'll start from post order this side. In pre-order, we started from root side, this side, since root was first element. In post-order, we start from right side. Fine. Okay. Now, among 40, 20 and 50, compare which element is coming first. So, the moment I compare 40, uh, the moment I compare 40, 20, 50, I see that 20 is coming first. Okay. So, what will happen? 20 will acquire the place. Now, I know very well that only 40 is left of 20, then 40 will come here. And 40 will come here, 40, I will make it very clearly. And only the element which is right of 20 is 50, then 50 will come over here. And if you want to check, check, this is the trade. Fine. So I have shown you both the methods by which you can create a tree using traversal. Fine. So one thing which is very important to understand is that if you have been asked to create a tree, if you have been asked to, to create a tree, then there will be two orders given to you. There will be two orders given to you. It could be either in order or pre-order or it, it will be either in order and pre-order and second, it could be either in order and post-order. So finally, which one is mandatory? In order to create a tree, in order is mandatory. Always remember, in order to create a binary tree, I'm saying binary, I'm not saying binary search tree. Always, these are two different terms. I'll explain you after, but when I teach you binary search tree, but in if you are asked to create a tree, then you will be given a two orders and in two order, one order will be in order and second could be any. It could be pre, it could be post.